Now, if you love lobster and you love prawns, you're going to love these very ugly crustaceans. These are Moreton Bay bugs, and these ones have come from Queensland. Moreton Bay bugs have an incredible sweetness to them, and I love the texture of the meat. Now, these bugs are fantastic cooked in the shell, and that's how I'm going to be cooking them today. I'm going to keep it really, really simple so we can really show off this gorgeous crustacean. So on its back, with a sharp knife, we want to cut straight through and then straight down. So just cut straight through there, flip it around, and then we'll cut all the way down through the head. We can split them in half and you can see that beautiful flesh in there. Now I've got a really hot griddle pan right here. I've been heating it up for a good five minutes. You can also do this on the barbecue. Griddle pan also works well, but just needs to be super hot and open the doors because it's going to get a little bit smoky in here. A little bit of olive oil straight onto the flesh of our bugs. And we need to season it. So salt on the flesh. And just for a little hint of spice, I have a little bit of chilli powder here and you only want a small amount. I'm going to cook them flesh side first, literally for 30 seconds. So you don't want to overdo it. We just want the presentation side to have a few griddle marks. Then I'm going to turn them over, cook them for another two to three minutes. The best thing about these Morton Bay bugs is that you can see when they're cooked because it's going to go from that clear colour to white. Now these are pretty much cooked and another indication to tell that they're cooked is have a look at the shell. See how it goes bright orange like this one here and that flesh is a lovely white colour. Okay, that goes off. I'm just going to do a really quick garnish so they can sit up nicely. Just some carrot here, a little bit of lime juice, which I'm just going to cut that in half. So almost dress this salad. It's not only to help the bugs stand up proudly, but also I love the taste and the crunch of that carrot with them. So a little bit of olive oil. And you can always have a little bit of salt in there. Just give that a toss. And we'll place that in the centre of our platter, just spread it out lengthways. Fabulous. And now onto our bugs. So we'll just take them out and just nestle them on top of, of that. And I like to have them head to tail. Gosh, it smells so good. I'll try to squeeze on that last little one here. We can't leave any on the pan. And with a little bit more of that lime juice, squeeze that over just before serving it. And there's no harm in a drizzle of really good Australian extra virgin olive oil to finish that off. Serve this to a big group of friends, maybe some cold beers on the side. A fantastic summer seafood spread.